What up, Doe Squad? We are back with another horror game. It's called Missing Hiker. This is a game I found on Steam. Uh, it is free to play. Basically, it's about a guy who's out looking for his missing brother. His brother went hiking, and his brother went missing, so you got looking for him. So, we're about to get go ahead and get into this and um, see how scary it is. If it's scary or not, or if the game is good or not, we don't know. But we're about to find out. Let's go. So right off the back, uh, if you've been following my YouTube channel and you've seen some of the videos I posted in the past, um, there was a game I was playing called Fears to Fathom. And it was a mission or it was a, uh, a map just like this. Um, basically we played as a young lady. Uh, she was um, driving back from an event or something and she ended up having to stop at a hotel. And if you watch the channel, you know how that played out, but this kind of looks like that. The same graphics that the old PS2 looking graphic, you know, with the block characters. And, um, yeah, it's basically like the same thing. So, maybe the same people that made that game have something to do with this, or they saw that game and took the, um, you know, the same route, took some stuff from it, basically replicated it. I don't know if these are the same people or not, but we'll see. So people been missing, y'all heard strange screams coming from the woods. Why didn't y'all got the police up here or nothing to check it out? That don't make sense. Can we go back there? Nope. That's a small gas station. I can't stand small gas stations. You can talk to him though. Such it for my brother. Dang, this dude rude. You could at least say, oh, I'm sorry to hear that, bro, or something. This guy got a whole attitude. It actually looked good, though, to have these graphics. Now, he did tell us um, it was a road behind the gas station. We got to walk up, so we're going to walk up this road and see what we find. But, yeah, the, the game actually looks pretty good to have these type of graphics like it's the simple things that matter as long as I can get a good scare or something
Now imagine actually doing something like this in real life. Now I've heard stories of people doing stuff like this. I see videos of people camping in the woods alone at night in their vans and stuff. Couldn't beat me. Hell no. All I'm gonna say is black folks don't do stuff like that. <laughs> We're coming up on something. What's that light over there? Make sure ain't nobody in the woods pop up on me. Your brother tent look different. Why are you checking on it? <laughs> Yo. <laughs> the pop up scares me crazy. You guys are some type of pervert. Why you pop up on me like that though? Was he did he knew did he know I was gonna come up here? We could have just very well heard my footsteps. That was crazy, though. I don't want to stamp you. Like, why are you out here, like, just camping in the woods? Why is his brother out here camping in the woods alone? Like, that don't make sense. Only serial killers camp in the woods alone. That's all I'm going to say. I also think they should get some voice acting in these type of games. Like, because you're not, I mean, I don't know how long it's taking them to make these games, but the fact that, you know, the graphics ain't all the way up to par, you know, these aren't very long games. So I think they should have some type of voice acting, you know, just to kind of make it a little bit better. Can I go in his tent or he said I needed a gun out here. I need to blam somebody. I need to get me a weapon. Cause there ain't no way I'm walking out in the woods by myself in the dark while it's snowing. Y'all know it's creepy when there's snow outside. You know when it's snow, if you live in like an area where it's snow and you go outside in the morning and it just be like quiet. You don't hear or see nobody. Cause a lot of the times when it's snowing, a lot of people tend to stay in the house. So you don't see a lot of cars on the road. I mean, except people that's going to work. But when you go outside, it'd be like quiet. Even at night, when it's snowing, it's just like this eerie feeling. I don't know if anybody else feel that way, but I feel that way. Like, and I always felt that way ever since I was a kid. Like, when I would go outside, it's just like this eerie feeling when it's snowing. Like, like somebody watching me or something. Whoever the developer is for this game, I can tell you already, bro, this walk is way too long, bro. Okay, we finally got to where we need to get to, because I'm like, how long we got to walk? And you should have probably added, like, some more scares during that walk, like, maybe, like, an animal or something jumping out, because the dude at the gas station did say there's animals out here, and we should be careful, so maybe an animal pop out and run past us or something. Something. You know, just for effects, like another little scare. I wouldn't be able to fall asleep.
Y'all hear that screen? Curious, how long he be looking for his brother, bro? Cause here another screen. Cause how you going to sleep already? If I'm looking for my brother and somebody close to me in the woods, I'm not going to sleep there early. Like that's where we gotta go. But yeah, I'm gonna be up. Like I ain't about to go to sleep. He looking, like bro, you just got here. Unless he been driving around for a while looking for him, and he just got here and this where we started from. I don't know, but ain't no way. And I went and came by myself. Like, why do you bring nobody? I know y'all got friends or something. Cousins. I'm understanding the thinking. But it's a video game, so. Let me not. Let me not go crazy with the. The theories and my thoughts. He found his brother bag, but it's empty. Man, check this out. Ain't no way. Creepy cabin in the middle of the woods. It's a small cabin. Somebody got hacked up here. Let me shut that door. No, not the light, the door. Somebody took pictures of his tent and his car. What's that on the table? Like, is that some like meat or something? There's two cans, so it's like, is that the same person or is it like multiple people? Somebody could have a drinking problem. I ain't gonna lie. Like, is it something here we gotta find, or was it just a picture and the pictures? I don't understand. Like, yo, y'all see that? Who's that? Who's that? Who's that? Who's that? We go outside. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> your body was never found I guess that's the end wow <laughs> okay I guess the moral of the story here is don't go in the woods alone looking for people that's lost and if you do go to the woods take somebody with you I say at least two more people you know Two could be enough, but the second person better know how to squabble or something, or y'all should take a weapon or something. If you go along, maybe you should have took a weapon, a knife, and a gun at the same time. You know what I'm saying? But I would at least have two more people with me. Somebody. Something. Uh, my thoughts on this game, uh, it's very short. There are no other endings. I mean, if it is, I didn't find it. It, it didn't really give me an opportunity to even go anywhere or look anywhere else, so... Um, yeah, I mean, it is a free to play game. Uh, I feel like they could have did a little bit more with the story. Um, a little bit more background why his brother was out here in the woods. Um, what was he doing over here? You know, um, I'm thinking, I don't know, I think. 
the killers were probably the guys in the gas station. I'm not sure. You remember the one guy I spoke to? He was kind of irritated. Actually, the one guy in the gas station probably was the killer. And then the guy we saw in the woods who told us we should have a gun or something. I'm thinking maybe it was those two. I'm not sure. Um, I'm going to go back through this game and see if this other stuff or other endings. And if it is, I upload it for y'all to see. But I'm pretty sure that was it. I'm not sure. But, I mean, I guess it was good. It had two decent scares, I guess. I mean, I guess the whole thing, why it's so kind of kind of eerie playing it, because you're by yourself, you're walking through the woods, got the VHS effect and all that to make it look a little bit more, you know, scary or whatever. But, yeah, let me know your thoughts on it. It was cool. But I'll catch you all in the next video. Peace.